For you to get back on pace, you have to get some wins. Get some wins going. And Yankton has got some wins going right now. And I love okay. When anybody drives into your town and they see these big old vacant stores, it just right away gives you a reflection of, uh-oh, something's not good here. Well, now guess what? These vacant stores are going to be utilized and refurbished, and there's going to be investments made into them. And I think that's one, again, it's a sign of strength. It's another win. I don't know how you did it, but my gut says is that it was just business sense. Boy, and that's why, that's why you know, city manager Nelson, uh, Commissioner Song, here's what I recommend. Look at the two buildings that we were just in, okay? What makes those, those buildings so valuable is that they are old. And they've got this, this incredible, you know, exposed brick, exposed wood, history. Yeah, they, they love this stuff. The, the, the exposed ceilings. That's why if you get people starting to invest in these old buildings, not only just for retail, okay? Remember what I said last time I was here. What I would do first is I would find a way to get as many people to live in downtown Yankton as you possibly can. Take every one of these second and third and fourth floors and find some developer, some investor who is willing to create lofts so that you can live downtown. Because then once you get people living downtown, then you'll get people playing downtown and then you get others, you know, working downtown and things like that. And you've got to. Uh, because it's, it's, it's my community, it's your community, they're your kids, it's your legacy. Uh, so do it. Do it. Uh, it's going to take a lot of risk, a lot of effort, a lot of pain. Uh, you're going you're gonna to make some people mad, but it's worth it in the end. So I would encourage you to, you know, to do it. So thanks for, thank you for letting me be here today. I'm proud of you. Uh, uh, I mean, this is an investment in your community that you're making. And I would encourage all of you to invest in, in, in this young professional, this young entrepreneur as well. But again, thanks for letting me be here today. I truly appreciate it. And why I ended that way, only God knows. Because I didn't intend that. Uh, and just tell, give Coach Boyster a hug. Okay? Okay? Thank you all.